Hello, I'm Bradley and welcome to my channel. First things first, if you're new here, please subscribe. You don't have to, of course, but it would really help me out in where I'm trying to get my channel to be. We all take things for granted. There is no getting away from that, even me. And I was thinking about this when I was just getting off to bed last night and I'd had a really, really difficult day, but I got through it. I got through it and in my prayers, it, it came across my mind and I thought, Do you know what? Even I take things for granted. And the one thing I took for granted yesterday was that I work in the family home. I grew up in this family home, incredible parents, blessing the parents. And my mum just is incredible. Absolutely, she's the first to do everything. She is the, the first one there if somebody's unwell or if something's wrong. And she just has a magical way of being able to resolve everything. And you know what, every single day of my life, she is always there to talk to. My dad as well, but my dad is still incredibly busy with work, whereas my mum is at home and just makes home amazing and runs after the family and just everything, incredibly busy as well. So they're both best friends of mine. They really, really are. My mum, even if I'm having a problem at work and I work from home a lot of the time through health and just because of the flexibility of my role, um, I had a real horrible issue going on, really, really stressed about it. Do you know what? And every time that happens, I, not even knowingly, take a moment or even on my lunch break or anything like that, I go downstairs and I vent to my mum. And never, ever once does she ever show an element of... I haven't got time for this, or I can't do this, or I, or I don't know what to say, or anything like that. She always seems to be able to put me back right on that, that, that just that position in life, on that road, our journey. The exact incredible thing to say just lift me out of it. A really, one of my favourite tasty lunches or something like that just seems to just happen, magically appear, and... I take that for granted. I truly do. I take that for granted. And I wanted to capture this on my channel because no matter how together we feel our life is, no matter how good of a person we believe everything is right now, there is always an element of our life we take for granted. And sometimes we should just show that little bit more of appreciation. I often think in through prayer, it has made me realise that, I mean, I have, unfortunately, a lot of health problems and things which I manage, and there's something going on in the background, which we'll be, we, I'll be talking about on the channel. I'm not quite there ready yet to talk about it, but through prayer and through my faith, which has really brought me a lot of strength, clarity and guidance in my life. Yes, and it was a sermon, actually, which I was listening to uh, recently, and... Um, it was it was it just lifted me out of how I was feeling on this particular moment that actually isn't it incredible that even though, yes, we've got something wrong, or we're going through something that we still sometimes not all the time and sometimes it's not going to be relevant to everybody. If you're going through something really major, really horrific and God bless you. And I really just to remind you that you, if you're going through a storm, these storms pass and behind us, that storm is a bright beautiful new horizon and if you're a faith or not you're amazing there's only one of you but going back to what I was saying it was that actually isn't it incredible that yes there's something going on in my life but I've got so much more to be grateful so much more to be appreciative and thankful for and yesterday was a bad day for me it's important to it's important to acknowledge that for our own mental health our own mental well-being so we can make sure that we don't sometimes go back there or slip back there or if we make a mistake we learn from it Mine yesterday was sometimes taking for granted that my mum, perhaps one day she, she's got so much on, perhaps she's not feeling great, but she still takes the time in her heart to listen to me. And I vent and she puts me back on that road. My dad does exactly the same. I take it for granted. Do you know what? I have such a close bond with them, but I take it for granted that they've always got the headspace or they're able to do that. So that was my little thing to share with you in regards to that. But isn't it just that fact that some of the most incredible, important things in our life, we not knowingly may take for granted. And I know there is a lot of huge stories about this that people take for granted one thing or another. And we do just waking up in the morning, breathing air, being able to stretch our legs, brush our teeth and start the day again. There are so many people out there who would only ever wish to do that. And do you know what? That's what really gets me through a really bad day and a really tough day. Even if I have different things with long-term issues going on in the background, if I have a bad day or something that's not quite right at work, I think to myself, do you know what? You're complaining, Bradley. You're moaning, Bradley. There's somebody who would give absolutely anything to be in my situation right now, and they would be grateful. They wouldn't be complaining about the small thing. And do you know what? That's not to demeanize or to belittle situations because it is important. They are important. When something goes wrong, it's important because it's your life. It's important to you. 
but it's also important to take a healthy gauge of perspective that actually you are going to be okay. If it doesn't go right today, it's not the end of the world. People go through horrific things every single day. We live in a fallen world. Let's try and add to the goodness. Let's try and spread joy, happiness, goodness, all those great, amazing things. And spread a little bit more of appreciation. So next time you're quick to think and you think to yourself, oh, I just can't deal with this or one thing or another. And if it's, we're talking kind of little things, but huge things to us, you know what I'm talking about. Sometimes let's just stretch that a little bit more, take a moment, breathe and appreciate all of the goodness in our life. I really, really hope that helps. And that was just playing on my mind and I wanted to capture on that my channel. So God bless you. Thank you very much for being here. And until next time, I'll be seeing you very soon. Bye for now.